Thank you for coming tonight to honor Mac, my bestest friend. He was so proud to be from Lubbock. And I just got to tell you guys, he would not have expected anything that has happened since his passing. From the moment I brought him home to you in his blue jeans, and you all were there to welcome him, the way everyone turned out, the way everyone's been writing to me and calling me and now tonight with this amazing tribute concert. I cannot tell you how touched I am. You guys are in for such a treat. Please welcome Don Caldwell, producer of this year's Love of Life. Man, am I excited about this. I mean, <laughs> there isn't any better music ever. Well, it was New Year's Eve. I was 14 at the time. The last few gigs that, that I saw him do, he would bring out a stool, and he would bring the stool and sit down and, and just say, "Howdy, folks! How's everybody doing?" And that's what we want to do tonight. And we want you guys to feel at home, all right? Like you're in his presence. There he sits with a pen and a yellow pad. He's a handsome lad. That's my boy. I'm gonna need a little honey.
You know, all of us have what we think is our favorite Mac Davis song. But I, I've heard Mac talk about this next song probably being one of his favorites, one of the songs that he was the most proud of. And it's a song that talks about something that a lot of us experience, and that's not being able to, to, to wait long enough to leave your sleepy hometown and go out and search for your fame and fortune. But then when it's all said and done, you never forget your roots, where you came from, and your hometown. You can bury me in love of Texas in my chair. 